Okay, this review is going to be much more casual, because people making this probably took it casually. So, this new Resident Evil movie is rebooting all of the movie franchise as a whole. This one is more faithful to the games. It's forgetting about the Mila Jovovich ones that they already did. This is more faithful to the game franchise as we know it, specifically of Resident Evil 1 and 2. And this movie's proof that a good script really helps a movie. Like always, but a bad script does not help your movie, no matter how good parts of it there are. Kaya Scodelario is a great Claire Redfield. I would, If they do end up continuing these movies, I would love to see more of her. But the biggest thing is, the dialogue goes like, Hello, I am Jill Valentine. Hello, I am Leon Kennedy. I do like the fact, though, that there are some uh, practical effects in here, and when the practical effects are used, they're actually used pretty well. The CGI, though, in pretty much every scene that it's used in is awful. Just genuinely terrible. I actually do think the production design was pretty nice. They recreate uh, the mansion from the first Resident Evil game. I don't know the lore that well, but the first, like, the main set from Resident Evil, the first game, is used in this, and it looks great. I also think the cinematography is used pretty well. Uh, Johannes Roberts, I believe that's the name of the director, he really knows how to make an engaging, claustrophobic movie. This just also happens to be a really bad Resident Evil movie. Look, this 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 movie's rough around the edges, sure. If you're a Resident Evil fan, I don't see why this would be the worst thing in the world. To me, I think it's fun. It really has its moments. There are parts of it that I appreciate as a filmmaker. But outside of that, there's really not much here. I don't know if this is going to continue because I didn't even know about this movie. And it's Resident Evil. So 